Hey, this is Clayton from Team Skyline, and I just discovered you can do voiceover on videos on iPhones. So this is what I'm doing. This is the first time I've done the RVO race ride, and uh, I had a GoPro, so I decided to shoot a little footage. And here we have everyone rolling out before the pace gets too high, and everyone's just cruising along, chatting up. The weather actually was really nice for the ride. It was about mid 70s and the wind wasn't too bad either. It was maybe like five, 10 miles an hour at some points, but other than that, it was a fairly calm night, so everyone rolled along pretty good. And here we are at the back of the pace line. We got Ryan and Mike. Ryan and Skyline Kid on the bus. This is where the pace starts to creep up a little bit. We got DC Velo on the front with the Got an orange kit, don't know who he is, but uh, yeah, from here the pace really only goes up. Going through here pretty good now. So here the brake's already established, and I didn't get the part where the brake starts to get away from the main group, but right now it's five guys and it's going pretty good. It's me, Ryan, we got um, Colin rolling off the front here. Then we got Mike behind me, and we got Andrew Duddle as well. So, pretty good group of guys rolling through the Holy Valley roads. It's a really beautiful ride, especially at speed, too. So, I was able to get the speedometer on some of these clips here. Um, GoPro Quick App on the iPhone doesn't love larger videos, but the shorter clips as they will get them up on here without too much of an issue. So some of them you'll get to see us rolling through and what kind of speeds we're doing. So this rat actually had a fair bit of cornering on it and it's always good to practice techniques, especially on roads that you don't know. So that it's not just from memory, it's also skill in the moment when you're doing it. So here we got another corner coming up. Mike here's on the front about to pull off and then we're gonna hit this left turn and try to keep the speed high through the corner especially exiting speed is important. So always trying to get a couple of pedal strokes going through the corner and out just to get the speed back up. Here we are about to take a swooping right-hand corner. Ryan's on the front, I'm on Andrew's wheel. And, uh, as we go through it here, you'll see up the road that there's a couple people on horseback and you always got have to look out for traffic. It's not just cars out on roads all sorts of things, so I've got to keep your eyes up the road. So here we're getting pretty close to the end of the ride, and uh, people are starting to get a little fatigued, but we're trying to keep pushing through and keep the speed high up and over some of these little rolling hills. Here you really can get a great sense of just how beautiful Holy Valley really is. Just the spectacular roads and riding it has to offer. So I was really glad I was able to get out there and mix it up. You know. Still cranking along pretty good here. Um, just keeping the pace high, it's four of us now. Just keeping it smooth. Oh yeah, reading material. Got a little downhill drop here and everyone's starting to anticipate the little steep kilometer climb at the end of this ride. 
So I forgot to record the climb at the end, so a little anticlimactic, but got the regroup there. And I was also able to get a couple KOMs on this ride towards the end, uh, including this little steep finishing hill. So I was happy with that. And it's a lot of fun to keep it fast. So hopefully we'll uh, get the whole team up here for the summer solstice double and uh, roll that fast as well. So looking forward to next time. Yeet.